Coming up next, it's a women's bantamweight matchup between Hazardous and Assassin. Our tale of the tape for this women's bantamweight showdown. Assassin is 24, Hazardous is 45. She is six inches taller. She will have a seven inch reach advantage. Once again, here's the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC. That's great. Hazardous. Are you ready? Assassin. Are you ready? Here we go. Fight scheduled for three five minute rounds. You can hear that one. Big roundhouse wow. kick. Oh, my! Big head kick! Looking to finish this fight! Back up. Oh, very nice. Strong jab. Oh, big shot. Man, outstanding takedown defense to him. Assassin with a kick to the bottom. Good jab. Welcome to the jungle. She continues to connect with her punches. Clean hook. Nice combination. That huge kick to the body was blocked. Nice switch. That's a clean left hand. Hazardous with a strong combination. Man, that jab's really effective here. Great job landing a series of punches. Solid jab. Hazardous with a combination to the body. And a look for the single. This is nasty. This is really tight, Mike. Lost it. Nice lost it. She's out. Completely lost the position. Moves to half guard. Posturing up. Beautiful sweep. We're back in the half guard. Nice shot. Right into guard again, Joe. Solid shot to the body. Looking for a triangle. Throws one leg over the shoulder. She popped out of the submission. Very nice. Gets to half guard. And now she's got full mount. Hip escape. Gets out of the full mount. Hazardous with a punch to connect. That's a big punch to the head from the top. Five Three. minutes in the books. Round one complete. A big knockdown that round from Hazardous. Huge knockdown. It was probably the most important aspect of that round and most likely won the round. Great finish in that round. Great finish in that round. Listen, how do you feel? Ready? Ready? Second round. She switched to right hand forward in southpaw. Oh my! Good spinning back kick. Nice jab. Body shots are becoming much more utilized than oh, oh my goodness! Hard straight punch. Rocked again. Oh, yeah. 
looking to finish it right here. That's it. Pin is all over. Set up the choke, completed the job, and got the victory. Once again, here's our fight replay. Let's see it again here. Got the choke. It's in deep and no choice but to tap. And here we see it from another angle. Beautiful technique here and the tap. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Coming up next, it's a women's bantamweight matchup between Hazardous and Evil Way. Our tale of the tape for this women's bantamweight showdown. Evil Way is 19, Hazardous is 45. The reach is identical. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC bantamweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. Hazardous. Ready to fight. Evil way. Ready. Here we go! Tonight's fight is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. What started with Ronda Rousey is now a very deep roster of talented female fighters who battle in the octagon. Their skill sets continue to become more impressive, and the compete level that these women bring every single time is absolutely amazing. The women go to battle. They put on a show, and they leave it all in the octagon. Continuing to strike well. Straight punch oh, gets through. Right. Big head kick. Looking to finish this fight. That's it. And it is all over. ground and pound combination that leads to the TKO. And With the official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, let
Coming up next, it is our main event of the evening between Bad Intentions and Hazardous. Our tip... Bad Intentions. Ready to fight? Hazardous. Ready. Here Ready. we go! Tonight's championship fight is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Precise jab by bad intentions. That connected. Hazardous gets caught by the kick to the midsection. Big roundhouse kick. Hazardous with a solid leg kick. Great job blocking that punch. Hazardous gets hit with that kick to the midsection. And now they clinch. Ah, that's a great trip as she gets the takedown. Elbows. In half guard now. Good ground and pound by Hazardous. In the full guard here. Back to half guard. Now falls back into guard. Gets to half guard. We are back in the half guard again. Wow, look at that. How good is that? Uh oh.
up next. This is a showcase of two of the most vicious strikers in the game today. Between the gentleman and the destroyer. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight collision. The destroyer is 30. The gentleman is 45. The destroyer weighed in at 265 pounds. The reach is identical. Once again, here's the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. It's his first fighting out of the blue corner. The gentleman, here we go, the destroyer. You ready? You ready? And here we go, a matchup of great strikers. And he parries it. The destroyer with the good leg kick. High kick. Oh, that's a big leg kick. What a jab. Back and forth battle. Oh, and he eats a shot. Good job blocking the punch. There's a body shot. There's a solid body shot. Nice, oh, nice. nice kick. Good combination, Joe. The gentleman gets hit with the kick. He's doing a really good job of timing his shots and landing a good series of strikes here. Man, he just avoided damage. Great block. High kick. The destroyer with a good jab. Both men landing in that exchange. Good connection with the straight by the gentleman. Manny's using his jab well in this fall. Solid kick by the destroyer. Two minutes. Good check. The destroyer with the nice jab. Good inside leg kick. Big kick. Oh, good combination. Strong jab by the destroyer. He's doing a great job of mixing things up here, keeping it unpredictable. One minute on the clock here in the first. Oh, double jab. Right to the liver of his opponent. You can tell he's hurt to the body here, Mike. Big shot from the clinch. Seconds. Look at this takedown. He connects with a big punch from the top.
Coming up next, it's a heavyweight showcase between the gentleman and dynamite. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Dynamite is 19, the gentleman is 45. The rest is virtually identical. With the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. The gentleman, Dynamite. And here we go, a matchup of great strikers. Black trunks for Dynamite, white trunks for the gentleman. Good strike in the clinch by Dynamite. And another one lands to the head. He clipped him with an uppercut. And again. And he got him again. The gentleman's right eye is looking pretty swole. Locks up the Muay Thai clinch. There's that knee. And separate. Tagged him. Caught him again. Good slip by the gentleman. Welcome to the jungle. Big shot with the straight. Doing a good job timing his shots here and landing a great series of punches. The gentleman with the punch to connect. Look at that. He's timing that jab. He had been landing knees throughout the night, and it is no surprise that his opponent could only take so much. And this last one was the one that finished the... Bruce Buffer has the... Coming up next, this may very well be a stand-up war between the gentleman and Pretty Boy. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Pretty Boy is 24, the gentleman is 45. Pretty Boy weighed in at 265 pounds. The reach is identical. Once again, here's the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, The gentleman, pretty boy. And here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for pretty boy. Black trunks for the gentleman. Tagged him. Nicely done. He slipped the punch. He was looking for the head kick, but it was blocked. Welcome to the jungle. Leg kick. Excellent head movement. Oh, big, big head kick in, Joe. He hurt him with that hook. Oh, oh he got rocked. rocked. Boy, he's in big trouble, Mike. Strong jab. Man, he just missed. Oh, big body kick. First 
first takedown of the fight. Good shot to the body. He escapes and he's back on his feet. Pretty boy with the kick to the body. Good straight punch. They are exchanging here, Mike. Dubois caught again. Joe, he's really on point with his strikes tonight. Quick kick. Good connection with the straight by Pretty Boy. He's got a beautiful leg kick. Good right-left combo by the gentleman. Using his jab very well. And another good body shot. Joe, you can see the significant damage on his opponent. And he counters with a straight left. He's doing a really good job of timing these shots. Oh, he caught him with an uppercut. And he's looking for that left. Trying to get a single. Big takedown late in the round. seconds remains in the round. Slides him over, and nice reversal here. 15 seconds. He's able to block the punch. That's the end of round number one. And here's a nice shot to the body. You can really see how awesome that round was by these highlights. Left, right, hooks. Ariani gets us set for round two. All right, here we go, round two. Now, starting off this round, he might still be hurt. He's going to want to look to be defensive and move and avoid getting hit and try to recover. Joe, he continues to defend. Man, he just slipped that right hand. Dubois with the good right hand. He was able to block that big kick. Solid straight. The most significant stat in this fight has been body strikes. Great job blocking that punch. Both men landing in that exchange. He's doing a very good job of controlling the center of the octagon, keeping his opponent to the outside. And there's a nice straight by Pretty Boy. And a good job. Another solid head strike by Pretty Boy. Joe, we're seeing some nice work. He's really staying busy. Wow! Oh, big kick! This is shot to the body. Good combinations. He connects again. And he gets up. The gentleman with the hook to the body. Pretty Boy is continuing to punish that wounded eye. And you can see that the swelling continues to get worse and worse. He's absolutely targeting that eye. You can clearly see, and he's landing combinations on it repeatedly. Pretty Boy's really suffered some damage on the left side of his body. Again, the takedown is stuffed. Good straight left by Pretty Boy. Tags him. Nice job blocking those strikes. Dubois with the straight left to the body. Beautiful body kick. Standing and trading. Exactly what we had hoped for. The gentleman gets hit with the kick. Man, consistent use of the jab. Outstanding. Pretty Boy gets caught with that left. 
He's doing a great job of utilizing the ground and pound here. Really getting off some excellent shots. Nice shot to the head. And in guard. Excellent punch. Man, he's doing some great damage from inside his opponent's guard. He's looking to stay busy on the ground. And that's the end of round number two. Last round, guys. You ready? You ready? Let's go. Five minutes left in the fight. Who's going to win this round? Joe, that was a good round we just saw. It'll be very interesting to see if the fighters can keep this pace, though. I think they will keep this pace. I think they're actually going to probably start tearing it up a notch as we head down the home stretch. Oh, nice. Good job blocking the punch. Oh! Solid straight left. Wow, that's a big wow. head tip. This could be it right here. Oh, very nice. Solid jab. He's looking to take the back. Huge oh, shot right to the hand. right. Excellent movement here on the ground. Oh, oh head kick it. to kick. Hard straight punch. There's a nice combination. Powerful jab. How good is this? The battle has been action-packed since the opening bell. Into the full guard. Pretty Boy's bruise on his body continues to get worse. It looks ugly. He's looking to lock in that leg here. All right, he's going for the heel hook here. What he needs to do, first of all, is break the full guard. Then from there, he's got to scoot his hips forward, throw his leg over his opponent's leg, lean back while controlling the leg, and he got his leg out. Wow, I thought that was it. Full oh, mount. And back up again. Good right hand. Right hand. hand. Gentleman circling to the right to avoid those big shots from his opponent. Oh, nice body kicks. Vicious body shots. Oh, nice jab. Oh, he lands the roundhouse to the body. Oh, oh, big right hand clipped him. Body kick, look at that. Takedown defense tonight. Tries for a low single. The gentleman gets the takedown. Transitions to full guard. And Great this fight. fight goes the distance. Both men did damage in what could very well be the fight of the night. But only one man will have his hand raised. It's really kind of a shame. I think that fight should be a draw because it was so close. Incredible back and forth action. Really fun fight to watch. Round three, this fun. And here's Bruce Buffer with.
Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight showdown. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight collision. The gentleman is 15 years his elder. The reach is identical. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. It's a division first. Fighting out of the blue corner. A mixed martial artist. He stands 6 feet 6 inches tall. Weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, USA. The King! And now the Madison is opposed. Fighting out of the red corner. A boxer. He stands 6 feet 6 inches tall. Weighing in at 250 pounds. Fighting out of St. Louis, Missouri, USA, Dubois! And with the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Lavin. Eve Lavin, our referee. Schedule for three five-minute rounds. <laughs> Look at that straight right Look in the body. <laughs> nice jab. Big battle early. He's defending nicely. Tagged him. He's keeping his hands up and avoiding damage. There's a body shot. There's a solid body shot. Goes for a single. Oh, and down. Nice shot. Excellent ground and pound here, not giving his opponent any breaks. Good body shot. Rubber guard. Looks like he's going for a choke. Just over three now. He got out of the choke. Now he's in full guard. He moves back into a rubber guard position. It appears he's going to attack with a submission. Yep, here he goes. He switches to the Gogo Plata. Can he choke him out? He's dead! It is all over! It is all over! He got the choke for the tap. Let's check out the action on our... Here... In
Coming up next, it's a heavyweight showcase between Fabricio Verdum and Iron Mike Tyson. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Verdum is 15 years his elder. He will have a six inch reach advantage. And with the official introductions, here's the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds of the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, Blaney, out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He's got five to ten inches tall, weighing in at 240 pounds. Fighting out of New York, Mike Tyson! Fabricio Verdun, Mike Tyson. Here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Joe Iron Mike, one of the most feared strikers in combat sports history. And what he liked to do in the boxing room is fight in a phone booth. He loves those quick hooks, but they're quick and they're powerful. And they led to a lot of his knockouts. Here in the octagon, he's going to work his footwork. He's going to try to cut off the cage and force his opponent to go toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Good striking. Oh, nice. His defense tonight's excellent. Tyson with the good punch. There he goes with the one-two. And that jab's really effective. Verdun gets caught with a kick. Wow, Joe. A lot of Fabrizio Verdun fans in the crowd tonight. Very good job of timing these shots here. Ah, uh, Joe, we can see the game plan. Punish his opponent's leg. Nice jab. Both men landing in that exchange. That's a good straight. And he lands a very nice combination. He's able to slip the left. Nice hands, really connecting with the punches. Tagged him. Verdun putting his striking on display again. Excellent head movement. Good jab. Continuing to strike well. Oh, nice elbow. He connects with the straight. Nice punch by Verdun. Landing at will. Big straight punch. Oh! The kick lands. He's stunned. He hurt him. Looking to finish the fight. Boy. Wow! Wow! That one dropped him. Wow! He's back up. Oh! He hurt him with that hook. This is a huge hook to the head. <laughs> Landing at will tonight. Tyson caught by a straight right. And he nails him again. Fabricio Verdun with some serious body shots. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. Verdun with a one-two that scores. And he connects with the left. That one hurt him. Big shot to the liver. He buckles. Oh, just like that. Fabrizio Verdun. Wow. It was a huge punch to the body that stopped this fight. Time now for our fight replay. As we see here in the replay, it's this nasty body shot. He's in big trouble here. He buckles over, and this is the TKO finish. You can see here from a different look, nasty shot to the body that lands absolutely perfectly. The legs go and gets the TKO. And let's check that out for Bruce Buffer has the...
Coming up next, it is our main event of the evening between Chris, the All-American Weidman, and one of the best middleweights in the world today, Chris Weidman. Our tale of the tape for this middleweight championship fight, both of the fighters are 31. The reach is identical. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan. Chris Weidman. You ready? Chris Weidman. You ready? And here we go. The middleweight title is on the line. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. White trunks for Weidman. Black trunks for the champion. Chris Weidman's takedown ability is one of his strongest weapons. He's doing a really good job of timing these shots. Misses the takedown. Weidman's blocked that strike. These guys are going at it here right away, trading blows. Nice jab by Weidman. Tagged him. Good block by Weidman. Found a home for that. Great defense. And he gets that right hand. That's a nice knee by Weidman. He got tagged there. Combination by the champion. Weidman gets caught by the inside leg kick. Joe, his jab, very effective in the play. Good job landing the series of strikes here. Joe again the inside leg kick by Weidman. Good straight punch. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. Oh, he tagged him again, Mike. He continues to connect with those punches. Joe, that was well done, blocking the punch. Oh, he lands the roundhouse to the bottom. Jab. He's doing a great job of mixing things up here, keeping it unpredictable. Right to the body. Man, you can see the effect of those punches that have landed because his left eye is really starting to close up. And again to the body. He's finding his rhythm here early in the round. Joe, he's really on point with his strikes tonight. Weidman's got him in the plum clinch. Under two minutes now. Huge Vicious elbow. elbow lands to the head. And again. Big one. Oh, and he eats a nice knee. Wow. He lands a huge knee. And he scores again with the elbow. Oh, beautiful knee. He hurts him again with the knee. Bruce Buffer has the
up next, it's a light heavyweight showcase between Daniel Cormier and vicious Brazilian striker Shogun Hua. Our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight fight. Daniel Cormier, Mauricio Shogun Hua. Here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Mauricio Shogun Hua loves to throw that overhand right. Keep an eye out for it. Nice straight to the body by Cormier. Good left hand. Shogun with the combination. Good nice. inside leg kick. He's doing a great job of timing these shots. That's a damaging knee to the body. He connects with the left. Big punches. He hurt him with that punch from the clinch. Excellent takedown defense. Good connection with the uppercut by Cormier. Tying up here in the clinch. Working to get an advantage. Good knee to the body by Cormier. Nice punch in the clinch. Strong knee by Cormier. Big uppercut. Both men landing in that exchange. Joan again, a big knee. These knees are brutal. Shogun with a big hook. Knees right here. He's got to get those knees to the body. He lands one. Man, he's really doing some damage with those knees. Very nice timing with these shots here. Battle for control here. They separate from the clinch. Just misses with the left. Big front kick. Nice Nicely front done. Kick. Nasty leg kick. He slips the punch. Good job blocking the punch. Tries for a low single. I can see the Olympic wrestling skills of Daniel Cormier. Now let's see if he can finish the fight. Left hand. Strong ground and pound by Cormier. That eye is going to be grotesque. Good strike from the top. He's got some time to work here, 45 seconds. Solid ground and pound by Cormier. Daniel Cormier with a big shot. He postures into place. He escapes and he's back on his feet. Seconds remain in round one. Round one comes to a close. Okay, you ready? Round two. You ready? Let's round two. Joe, we saw a bit of action in the first round. They're getting each other's timing down, starting to figure out the distance, and I think they're going to get after it now. Cormier is one of the ultimate in competitors. A tough upbringing, and truly a man who has competed at the elite level for decades. Tagged him. Nice job slipping the punch. Joe, look inside the numbers. Significant strikes landed. He just missed with the right. Big leg kick land. There's a nice combination. Oh, stunning jab. Oh, very nice. There's a good kick by Daniel Cormier. You know, Joe, he's not really known for his Muay Thai. He's known for his toughness and his wrestling. But he's looking to set up more opportunities to score with that kick. 
Goes for the head kick, but doesn't connect. And he's taken down by Cormier. <laughs> and looks like Hua is cut. He hip escapes. He's out of the full mount. Full guard here. Back to half guard now. Passes from half guard, now into side control. Just over two remain. Tags him. Good punch. Hua gets it back to guard. Nice strike from top position. Good elbow by Hua. He's taking some big shots in the bottom. Good job from the top by Cormier. Joe, that's a nice elbow from the bottom. Man, he's doing some great damage from inside his opponent's bar. Into half guard again. Good ground and pound by Cormier. Daniel Cormier's a beast on the ground. His ground and pound is ferocious. Very dangerous guy if he gets on top. They're back up. He tries to take him down with the single, but doesn't get it. Cormier with a good jab. Great exchanges. 15 seconds. Good connection with the straight by Shogun. This fight very well may be stopped in between rounds just because of the blood loss, Mike, because that is extraordinary. Here we see a nicely timed elbow. The lovely Ariani here tonight. In Last round, guys. You ready? You ready? Let's go. Five play. minutes left in the fight. Who's going to win this round? Man, he just slipped that right. Good counter with the right. Oh, and he ate a front kick. He's doing some damage with those kicks. That punch was blocked. Strong jab by Shogun. Here's your updated numbers for takedown defense. Big straight to the body by Hua. Good inside leg kick by DC. Shogun with a straight that scores. Nice hand. Great front kick to the face. He looks for the single but can't get it. Really good movement on the ground. Let's see what he can do from here. Hip escape. And he's out of the full mount. Nicely done. Cormier's eyes are both starting to swell pretty badly now. Big punch. There's some hammer fists. Three minutes remain in the fight. That Vicious was a elbow nasty lays to the elbow. head. Looking for the knockout. There's a big left hand. hand. Huge bomb from the top. Wow, look it at that. That's it. TKO. Daniel Cormier with the victory. Daniel Cormier was on fire tonight, and a big part of his success were his takedowns. Joe, here's the finish on our fight replay. We can see it here on a different angle. There are some big shots getting through here. Vicious ground and pound combination that leads to the TKO. And here we see one more time, big shots unanswered, not defending himself. The referee comes in to save him. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen.
up next, it's a lightweight bout between Anthony Showtime Pettis and former top contender Nate Diaz. Our tale of the take for this lightweight fight. Pettis is 29, Diaz is 30. He is two inches taller. He will have a three inch reach advantage. And now with our official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Anthony Pettis. You ready to fight? Nate Diaz. Ready. Here we go. Tonight's fight is scheduled for three five minute rounds. White trucks for Diaz. Black trunks for Pettis. Anthony Pettis is one of the most dynamic kickers in the game today. Oh, nice. He just missed with the straight right. He did a nice job blocking the head kick. Joe, we're a minute into the fight, and both men are still trying to find their range. This is still a feeling out process. Both guys are trying to find their timing, and you're right, neither guy has really stepped out ahead. Good side kick to the midsection. Wham! The right and the left behind it. Head kick. Nicely done. And he lands the roundhouse. Trying to grab the leg, and he does. And he's got the single leg takedown. Good left hand by Diaz. He's in guard here. Nice punch to the body. Pettis with some strong elbows. Nice strike from top position. Man, he's doing some great damage from inside his opponent's guard. Good elbow from the bottom by Pettis. Nice punch. He got his hips well enough to get back to half guard. He hip escapes from the full mount. Pettis gets it back into his guard. Brutal strikes landed from the full guard. Pettis with the elbow from the bottom. Nice. Back to their feet. And the clinch. Good knee to the body by Pettis. Short uppercut. Good Safe defense. for now. Diaz gets the takedown. Set up by that nice combo. In the half guard. And he connects. Let's see what he can do from here. Excellent posture. Pettis is cut. Nice left by Diaz. Up again. Good nice. inside leg kick. Blocked. He's hurt, Mike. That was loud. Ugh. Nice work on the counter. Wow, what a great job mixing things up. Big wow. uppercut there. Man, he just missed. What a way to work at the finish of this round. Here we see a perfectly timed. We really got a chance. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. Second round. Joe, that's a solid leg kick by Pettis. Big kick just missed. And connects with the jab. Pettis with the combination. He avoided damage blocking the big kick. Pettis with the good left. Very nice shots landing. Pettis is... Oh! oh! Boy, he is in big trouble, Mike. Oh, he connected with an elbow. That's a big elbow. Look at that! Up.
lightweight bike. Both biters are 38. The reach is identical. Fabricio Verdun. Fabricio Verdun. And here we go! Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Verdun. Black trunks for Verdun. Fabricio Verdun is a full and complete mixed martial arts fighter, and although many know him for his incredible Brazilian jiu-jitsu, his takedowns are very good as He's well. looking for the inverted triangle from side control. Traps the arm, throws his leg over the top. He's looking to finish right here. That is very tight. This may be the end, Joe. Bruce. Coming up next, it's a light heavyweight matchup between Mike Tyson and the youngest champion in UFC history, Johnny Bones Jones. Our tale of the take. Mike Tyson, John Jones. Ready to go, first round, you ready? You ready? Let's Here go, we go. Come on. Tonight's fight is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Jones. Black trunks for Tyson. John Jones relies on his kicks more than almost anybody in the division. His kicks are outstanding. Good block, and he delivers the straight counter. Nice job keeping those hands busy. Joe, you can hear Greg Jackson in the corner of John Jones telling him to keep moving his feet. Good body shot. Combination. These guys are going at it here right away, trading blows. Good side kick to the body. Jones with some big kicks. John Jones with some vicious kicks. Joe, you're all over it. The kicks to the body, a true factor in this fight. Jones with a nice side kick to the body. Good punch. Tyson's body punch is blocked. Jones with a solid side kick. Good side kick to the body. That he lands a huge elbow to the head. Oh, that hook did damage. Just missed with the big left. Big nice shot left to hand. the left. Vicious shot to the body. Big straight punch. Solid jab. Vicious combination. Damaging left, left hand. Beautiful body shot there. Too. Powerful strikes. Oh, huge right hand. Big shot again. Good combination. Hard straight punch. Nasty combinations here. Oh, that one hurt him. There's a left that connects. Oh, that 
that rocked him. Shot. Trying to stay out of trouble here. Oh, stunning jab. Big combination. Hard straight punch. Man, he just missed. Strong jab. Oh, oh, combination. Oh, and another one. That hurt him. Big punches landing. He landed a huge uppercut. Big straight punch. Nice combination. 15 seconds left in the round. Oh, he's landing at will. Flying knee! What a way to work at the finish of this round. And here we go. Let's take a look at some of this action here. And here's a nice shot to the body. And here's another beautiful punch to the body. And here's another perfectly placed punch to the body. Incredible striking on display in that round. You gotta start covering up. You got me? Look at me. Cover your body. Move. Don't stand still. Don't. The beautiful Ariani getting us set for round number two. Round two. Now, starting off this round, you've got to think that the barrage that he endured in that last round is still affecting him. He's going to want to start this round off and move and avoid taking any damage. Good job blocking the punch. <laughs> Missed that shot. Jones with a good punch. That was a vicious knee that he just blocked. Solid straight by Tyson. All right, we take a look at the takedowns landed so far. Joe, that was a nice side kick. Tyson with the strong lead right. Mike Tyson's continuing to punish that eye. Yes, he is. That's a good target for him. He sees the swelling, and it's going to impede his opponent's vision. Beautiful right leg kick there. He's doing some damage with those kicks. John Jones with some vicious leg kicks. Joe, he's landing at will. Nice block, good defense. Solid defense. Oh, oh big right hand. right hand. Oh. What a huge right hand. Hard straight punch. Combination. Powerful jab. Back and forth battle. Oh, and he goes up top of the kick. Oh, big body kick. Rocked him with that right hand. Good combinations. Big power jab. Hard straight punch. Jones with a solid sidekick. Tyson's eyes looking really swollen. You've got to wonder whether or not it's actually a fractured orbit. He lands an excellent oh, combination. That hurt him. Oh, he rocked him with that right hand. Trying to connect on that jab. Good, solid straight right. Tyson with another straight right. That punch was blocked. Jab. Nice kick. That's, That's a huge big left. left hand. 15.
Big straight punch. There's a nice combination. We have completed two rounds. Here we go, last round. You ready? Are you ready? Third go, and go. final round. Good kick with the right by Jones. Oh, that's a big straight. Kick was checked. More absolutely brutal leg kicks from Jones. Good kick to the leg of his opponent. Tyson's bruise on his thigh is getting worse and worse. There'll be no dancing later tonight. Joe, look at that. Sizable advantage in the leg kicks. Tyson with the combination to the body. He's doing a great job of timing these shots. He just missed with the straight right. He's got heavy leg kicks. Another big kick lands. Oh! I like that, Mike. I like how he's mixing it up. He oh, lands a huge hand. left. Big combination. Solid right hand. Big shots. Nice leg kick. What a jab. Oh, Joe, another strong jab. Good job blocking the punch. Joe, as the clock ticks down, this fight still belongs to anybody. This fight is there to be taken. I have it completely dead even right now. One of these guys steps up and makes a big statement. They can win this fight. Good one, too, by Tyson. Straight right. Good block there. Looking for the high kick. Tyson with the good left. Tyson checks that kick. Can't connect with the jab. Nice punch by Joe. Look at this. Oh, he missed that kick. That straight right just missed. Tagged him. Good combination there. Flag me. For the knee. Great job blocking that punch. Excellent jab by Jones. This what one goes the distance. What an outstanding back and forth fight. Mike Tyson's knocked down earlier in the... the decision. up next. It's a middleweight matchup.
between Chris, the All-American Wideman, and Robert, the Reaper Whitaker. Our tale of the tape for this middleweight fight. Weidman is six years his elder. He will have a five-inch reach advantage. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds of the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 17 wins, four losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Chris Weidman, Robert Whitaker, and here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. One thing to keep an eye out for is the wrestling of Chris Weidman. He is a former NCAA Division I All-American and has outstanding wrestling ability. Clean right hand. Weidman with the punch that connects. Oh, he lands the roundhouse to the body. Again, amazing, amazing. He's able to slip the left. Whitaker's blocked that strike. Missed the mark. Oh, he tagged him with that straight. Huge leg kick. Oh, big right hand. Right hand. Just missed. Three minutes. Weidman with the left. Chris Weidman with a nasty leg kick. Nice straight to the body. Doing a good job with his striking. Strong jab by Weidman. Good block there. Stiff left by Weidman. Good leg kick. Double jab. Nice job slipping the punch. They are exchanging here, Mike. Big power in the leg kicks from Weidman. Solid kick. Nice kick. Weidman with some solid inside leg kicks. Quick jab connects. He's able to block the punch. Uh, this crowd very vocal and supportive of Chris Weidman. He's looking for a right hand, Mike. Excellent jab by Weidman. One minute remains. He avoids damage with the nice block. Man, Joe, he is truly showcasing his striking skills. Nice shot. Trying to grab the leg, and he does. Looking for the single. 15 seconds. Snapping that jab. Looking for the takedown, wants the single. And here's a nice shot lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And enough very impressive striking going on in that round. Slow that heart rate down. Everything you're throwing is working, okay? Here we go, second round, you ready? You ready? Here we go, go. round two. Joe, that was a good round. But let's see if the fighters can even turn it up from here. That was a solid round. The feeling out process is over. I think they're gonna get after it now. I've been very confident in his skills everywhere in a fight. He's worked diligently to be a better striker.
to be he's, better at submissions. He was already an excellent wrestler. Yeah, he's deceptively good at distance, Mike. It's one of the things about him, the way he moves in and out before he commits to striking. Very good at distance. He's back up. Solid uppercut by Weidman. Short uppercut. Again with that uppercut. Man, we have seen so many lethal body shots. It makes you wonder how he is still in this fight. Caught him with that one. That was a vicious knee that he just blocked. Under three now. Good roundhouse kick to the midsection. Changing stances. Weidman with the good straight. Beautiful body kick. Caught him with a punch. Another nice kick. Very solid. Goes for a single. Weidman with a good straight. Weidman connects. Joe, he's one of the most powerful punchers in the UFC's middleweight division. Very good job of timing these shots here. Boom, right on the button. Joe, that was well done, blocking the punch. Damn Damaging left, left punch. hand. There's a left that connects. Big takedown. The swelling on his eyes is starting to get really bad. Nice ground and pound by Weidman. In full guard. Now made a good, oh, good elbow. elbow. Very nice. Whitaker gets back up again. Just 20 seconds remain. Good slip by Whitaker. Misses the takedown. Yeah, Round up. two in the books. All right, let's check out some of the action from that round. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here, incredible. There we go, final round, you ready? You ready? Let's Five go. minutes on the clock. Joe, these guys are going at it. This has been a pretty good fight. This has been a pretty good fight. They're really getting after it. Solid left by Whitaker. Delivered that right to the midsection of his opponent. Joe, he's landing at will. That jab is lightning fast. Back and forth. Good job blocking the punch. He slips the punch. And right behind it. Joe, look at that. Sizable advantage in the late kicks. Good job blocking the punch. That's Faraz Zahabi in his corner, telling him to stay busy, Joe. Wow! Nice jab. Beautiful body shot there, too. Strong jab. Under three remains in this fight. Good combination. Beautiful right hand. Joe, you can see the effects of those body shots. There's a ton of bruising on his right side. He continues to connect with those punches. Found a home for that. Joey's starting to establish that over there. Oh, he missed that kick. Nice counter by Weidman. Oh, there beautiful go. combination. Good work blocking that. 
trying to get a single. And back up again. Just misses with the left. Tries for a low single. Whitaker gets back up again. Weidman with the block. He connects with the straight. Robert Whitaker is continuing to punish that wounded eye. And you can see that the swelling continues to get worse and worse. He's absolutely targeting that eye. You can clearly see, and he's landing combinations on it repeatedly. Man, Joe, he's connecting with those punches. Good defense, and he counters with a straight. 45 seconds. He tries for the single, but doesn't get it. Lands a nice left. Whitaker with a combination to the midsection. Both men landing in that exchange. Beautiful counter. He's keeping busy here, connecting with a lot of punches. Still a mouse under his right eye. Man, that was a perfect counter punch. Great takedown defense right there. Very nicely done. They Great go fight. the distance. What an outstanding fight. It was a back-and-forth battle, worthy of fight of the night consideration. Now, let's find out. up next, it's a lightweight matchup between Habib, the Eagle, Nurmagomedov, and vicious striker, Edson Barboza. Our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Barboza is three years his elder. He is one inch taller. He will have a five inch reach advantage. Once Habib, Nurmagomedov, Edson Barboza. Here we go! Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Barboza. Black trunks for Nurmagomedov. 
Edson Barboza is one of the best kickers in all of mixed martial arts. He has an excellent overall striking game, a very good ground game as well. What Edson is known for most are his beautiful kicks. Adjo right to his specialty. The takedown to Nurmagomedov. Nurmagomedov with the left. And now he's in full mount. Postured up. Great work from the bottom. And he's got some good effectiveness going with the ground and pound. Nice punch to the head from the top. It appears the cut on his cheek is getting worse. Barboza with a nice punch from the bottom. Back up to his feet again. He avoids the clinch. Oh, and he goes up top with a kick. Hard straight punch. Big oh shot. Oh my, he got rocked. Man, he's in big trouble. I like that, Mike. I like how he's mixing it up. He's got a choke here. He's locking that choke in. He's in a dangerous spot here, Mike. This anaconda choke is getting tighter and tighter. He might have to tap. He got it. He, he got it. Nicely over. done. He got the choke for the tap. With Coming up next, it's a lightweight bout between Conor, Notorious McGregor, and Ultimate Fighter winner, Tony Ferguson. Our tale of the tape for this lightweight collision. Ferguson is five years his elder. He will have a two-inch reach advantage. And with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds of the UFC. Lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a freestyle fighter, holding a professional. Conor McGregor, first run, you Tony ready? Ferguson. You ready? Here Let's we go. go. Tonight's fight is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. Oh, solid jab. Very nice. Good pop. 
Punch. Big battle early. Good block there. You could hear that one. Not a chance on that one. That's a nice punch by Ferguson. Oh, big right hand. Hard straight punch. Oh! Wow! <laughs> Trying to stay out of trouble here. Oh, that's a heavy body kick. Big knee. Vicious he lands elbow. a huge elbow to the head. Nasty combinations here. And an elbow. Tying up the clinch, looking for openings. McGregor with the good takedown. Three minutes. Good work from the bottom. And back up. McGregor with the jab. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. Several vicious elbows so far in this fight, Joe. His opponent needs to be careful. Good striking. Oh, oh head kick. Kick. the kick. Nice elbow. That's a strong Muay Thai plum clinch. And he pulls away. There's a good jab. He lands an excellent combination. Swing and a miss. He's been really effective with his jab here, Joe. Nice hands, really connecting oh, with the hurt. punches. Oh, he is hurt. Body kick, look at that. Joe, there's another shot to that cut that occurred earlier in the fight, and now it's really wide open. Yeah, he keeps tagging him right on that same spot. That's a clean left hand. Good offense from inside the half guard. Nice left. He's got the full mount, Joe. Wow. wow. That was a big left hand he connected with. Well, one in the books. They're going to need to take a look at this. Conor McGregor's eye is not looking good. His eye is swelling shut. That's going to impede his peripheral vision. It's going to impede all of his vision at this point. It's all right. Here's a solid elbow to the head. There's the beautiful Brittany as we get set for round two. You go, second round, you ready? You ready? Let's round go. two. Now, starting off this round, he might still be hurt. He's going to want to look to be defensive and move and avoid getting hit and try to recover. There's a nice left hand. Trying to punish the midsection. He's doing a really good job of timing these shots. He slips the punch. Ferguson gets caught by the inside leg. Very nice kicks. Numbers don't lie, and keep in mind. He's oh, he got rocked! Oh, my goodness! <laughs> oh, and he eats a shot. He hurt him with that punch from the clinch. Joe, everyone in attendance tonight might actually be Irish. Listen to the support for Conor McGregor. Nice knee to the body. Great trip, and he completes the takedown. That swelling on his eyes is really starting to get bad.
Trying to mount, he's got it, full mount. He's got the arm trapped of his opponent, good defense. Beautiful reversal, big body punch. Looking for mission control here, he's got it. Using the rubber guard. He's getting beat up a bit with elbows here. And he postures up. Under two minutes. And he's able to get back up to his feet. Good counter kick by Ferguson. And he connects. Nice. Good body kick. Joe, he continues to put together great combinations. That jab, extremely effective throughout this entire fight. Great jab by McGregor. Just misses with the left. Good straight to the body. He tries to take him down with the single, but can't get it. He lands a head kick. Big punch. Nice combination. He scored big with that knee. Huge Vicious elbow. elbow lands to the head. again with the elbow. There oh, he is! Got the takedown. And the round is over. Huge takedown in the final seconds. Conor McGregor's cheek is a mess. The doctor's gonna need to take a look at that. That cheek cut is really disgusting. I think they need to step in and end this contest. And there's a nice knee to the body. And here's another knee to the body. More. Here we go, last round. You ready? Are you ready? Let's Third go, and final on. round. Ferguson caught by that inside leg kick. He connects with the straight. Ferguson's cut on his nose is just pouring blood. Oh, he clipped him again. Excellent job of timing these combinations. Oh! McGregor with the nice jab. That punch was blocked. Man, he just flipped that right hand. Good roundhouse kick to the midsection. Wham! The right and the left behind it. Oh, he caught him. doing a great job of mixing things up here, keeping it unpredictable. Excellent jab by Ferguson. Great job with the roundhouse. Right to the body. Oh, huge kick to the midsection. Oh, that's a big head kick. Hard straight punch. Combination. Big power jab. These are some bombs he is throwing. Oh, and another one. That hurt him. And he turned it around into full guard. McGregor's eyes are both starting to swell pretty badly. Wow, that's hard a big shot with hand. the left. Elbowed him in the face. Vicious shot to the body. Into half guard again. Oh, some heavy shots from the top. Trying to pass here. Oh, that's a great block to that big kick. These guys are still going at it. What a tremendous fight it's been, and they're still laying it all on the line trying to finish this. Punches and punches. He wants to finish. Oh! 
the left hand. Vicious, vicious punch combinations here. Trying to get to side control there. Not much time left. And what? this one. Standing fight. As the judges get set to render their decision, it is. And with the decision, Bruce Buck. 